Scotland's starting hooker in the Six Nations, Ross Ford, Fraser McKenzie. Phil Burley, that's a nice move by Edinburgh. Now it's Tim Visser and it's Johnny Sharples. I want to check a tackle from Red. Okay. Without ball. We saw Gloucester attack from first phase. This time it's Gloucester. It's Edinburgh doing it. Oh, that's yeah. a high tackle. Oh. That's dangerous. That's Billy Meek. That's Billy Meek. That's 13. Billy Meek. Yeah, yeah it's Billy Meek's on Sam Beard, who's, who's just staggered off the pitch, looking a little bit stunned. Yeah, that's taking an angle and he jumps up. Um, that's a card. For me, that's a yellow card. Still checking, still checking. Well, if it is a yellow card, yeah, and for me, it's closer or giving. I have a decision. Edinburgh, yeah. every opportunity it's it, to get it back is into this game. Tackle, yeah. Without the ball. Okay. By the number. By the number 13. Red. 13. 13. 13. Uh, please. 13 red. Okay. And your recommendation is the red card? My recommendation is a red card. Red card red. recommended by my Eric Goza. Red card. Red card. Oh my goodness. Yes. What a turning Against, point this could be 13, in this final. Red. 13 red. Captain. Captain, 13. Oh, Jerome Gar says the man who, who sent off Jared Payne, you might remember, in a, a Heineken Cup quarter it's final tackle. last season. Sorry. Tackle without the ball is height and dangerous. Oh. And TMO recommend me a, a red card. Red card? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's going to be red for Billy Meeks. So Gloucester somehow have to survive this last 17 minutes. With 14 men at the moment, it's 13 because they still have a man serving time. Well, if Gloucester do end up losing this game, they've been architects of their own downfall. Sheer madness. The two cards, first by Moriarty and this time by Billy Meeks, just took him out. Keep, keep the line. They even jumped up to put that tackle in. Billy Meeks, who was the hero of the quarter-final and the semi-final, very much... The villain here.